Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you've been having the best of holidays. I have been loving mine, but I have to give you guys a story that I need to break. And it's not really the most joyful one, but what can be done? So, as you guys may or may not know, there are about 2,000 plus different types of cryptocurrencies and blockchain at the moment. Well, with that large of a number, there are bound to be some bad actors, some fraudsters, scammers. Let's just call them uh, very cunning people to be nice. Well, one of them you may have heard of, BTCP. It's a coin that stands for Bitcoin Private. Let's just say Coinmetrics recently conducted an investigation into this cryptocurrency and they found something really interesting. So it turns out that during their hard fork, somebody covertly mined 2.04 million BTCP. That's right, it just happened. <laughs> Don't believe me? Have a look at this. Don't think that that's bad enough? Well, if we look at the price set for the coin before this exposure, if we want to call it that, well, then the total hidden amount of coins was at 3.9 million. Now, the BTCP team confirmed this themselves by stating that they were never intended to be on the blockchain. So, I passed this information on to my buddy Luis, and he did his own little side investigation. What he found out was that they were victim of a 51 attack. Do you guys know what that is? Well, if you don't, Luis is going to tell you all about that next. In the meantime, right below here in the comments, if you'd like for me to continue this investigation into BTCP, I know I would be so keen on doing that myself. And yes, it's about that time, Luis. Come on, buddy. Start your traditional episode without me again. All right, Luis, you don't even have to give me credit. After all, this is my job and my vocation. Thanks, Stan. Guys, 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 I have a special episode for you. News is important, of course, but there is a topic that affected me even more. It goes about safety. One little spoiler for you. Any blockchain can be hacked, even Bitcoin. In general, guys, here's the thing. You've probably heard that blockchain is the safest technology in the world that cannot be hacked. That's true but only to a certain degree. I will try to explain in plain words. The majority of the existing coins operate on the principle of proof-of-work consensus. In the center of this mechanism are miners. They produce the power, aka hash rates, needed to mine blocks. The blocks store data on all transactions, that is, miners create a chain of blocks, thereby ensuring the operation of the system. Of course, they do it not for free. For example, Bitcoin miners get 12.5 BTC per mine block. Why am I doing this? Thousands of miners work over the very BTC blockchain, and none of them produces more than a half of hash rates. After all, if at least one gets more than 51% of capacity, he will be able to do whatever he wants with the blockchain. This is called a 51% attack. What could be the solution? Yes, to create coins that you can spend forever. For example, you conducted an attack on the no-name coin, got a pile of coins, brought them to the exchange, exchange for dollars, and voila! You have a solid currency in your hands, and this can be repeated hundreds of times. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> There's no need to panic and give up on cryptocurrency. In reality, guys, the demanded coins are almost impossible to hack. For example, to break BTC, a dozen supercomputers is needed and billions of dollars. But there is hell of, ugh, to put it mildly, less protected cryptocurrencies, and they are hacked all the time. One of the latest cases is Vertcoin. In early December, experts determined that the coin underwent 51% attack. Double loss is estimated at $100,000. Another example is Verge. In May of this year, using this attack, the hackers hijacked tokens for $1.7 million. And this was already the second attack on Verge this year. Not enough arguments yet? <laughs> In the same year, hackers hacked Bitcoin Gold and Monacoin. For the first one, the losses are not known until now, but the second one had a loss of about $90,000. Don't believe me yet, guys? Then I'll show you right now how it works. Recently, I received an insight saying that the BTCP coin was hacked with 51% attack. 
Because of this, the exchanges suffered major losses, but representatives of the coin refused to compensate them, arguing that the exchanges were the ones to blame for that. Well, guys, how was it? <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Stay secure, guys, and I'm leaving to get you some more interesting material. Hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. See you soon.